This is Elizabeth Hager. It's July 9th, 2005. It is my hope that this is the last you will hear of me. For 20 years, I have been working toward this moment. I have been a Federal Bureau Investigation agent. I've always been one time fascinated by shoes. Shoes are our connection to the earth. I first signed up to become an agent with the FBI in 1975. I was an agent for 20 years. For the last 10 years I've worked on my own. I know a lot of people think I'm kind of crazy in my approach to shoes. I've come to the point where I don't like too much separating me from the earth. Shoes are very interesting. They all have specific kinds of heels or they have a specific uh, wear. I've always found it curious. They have driving to a crime scene. On occasion, there would be shoes dangling from power lines, or there might be a single shoe in a ditch. And for several years, I had been assigned to work on missing persons. In 1981, I went to Shiloh, Ohio, on a missing persons report. It was a Jimmy McAllister, black suede platform. All the ankle strap. I had to go on was a high heel. Brown six. wingtip. In 1992, I found a pair of gold LeMay shoes. In 1988, uh, when I was still with the Bureau, uh, I was called to Flagstaff. In 1994, in 1999, I found a pair of gold LeMay shoes. It's interesting sometimes. You're, you're faced with a puzzle, and you've lived with trying to figure something out for. I'm sitting here now, well, speaking into this tape recorder, because I believe I understand the code. I believe I understand the formula that it takes from the longitude and latitude that I had worked out. And all the numbers correspond to those in my database that I had used to predict this I location. believe I have an understanding of what the numbers mean. A lot of whispering is about what a crackpot I am. I think this is the proof I need that will show that my theory is correct. And I think this is my opportunity to prove them wrong.